Faith Brothers here in Robin, Vermont, and I have some thoughts on the health care proposal. I am a registered nurse, the specialty is rehabilitation. I have worked many years helping people to get better and maintain, uh, to get better and to maintain their health, but prevention all of a sudden seems to be taking the forefront at last. We have put all our money into taking care of the immediate needs and perhaps not as much in the long-term care needs. We have many people now with many long-term care needs because we do such a great job at saving people's lives. With a health care proposal, since we don't really know what it is, I must say I do feel prevention is where it is. Of course you have a group of older people, you know, those over 40, 50 now who are going to need care for those conditions that they didn't necessarily take care of or know that it's going to happen. I am, I do think we need to prevent and help the things. I'm especially interested in the children, mothers and babies. For instance, like autism, there's one in 166 in this country being born that have autism. It's something we need to look at and find out the reason why to prevent it. I also think we really need to help pregnant mothers. I don't think it seems that Nancy Pelosi thinks, you know, abortion is certainly, you know, the first line of defense. Well, if you look at Europe, uh, their numbers are low in their birth rates. The only reason we have higher numbers is because of the immigrants. So now that we have these big bills and trillions and billions we're giving to China, uh, anybody figured out who's going to pay for that? Um, you know, it seems to me that we need to be thinking of the big picture. People have health care today that they're happy with. Some people have health care that they're not happy with, and others have none. Let's take those who have none and do something. I think in the long run, we're all going to have to tighten our belts, and we have to do something for everyone. But we don't necessarily have to do everything for everyone, because we cannot afford